bank, an old woman asked me to check her balance. So I pushed her over. <laughs> What's a bank? That joke will never not be funny to me. Hello, my beautiful Maddie squad. My name is Madison Brunaler, also known as Maddie to the Max. And welcome back to me doing impressions. And this week I am going to be doing... <coughs> pun impressions number nine! Yay! And per tradition, this is my geeky t-shirt. That's right. I have my own merch! Hello, my beautiful Maddie squad on the front. Don't you forget to keep smiling on the back. And in between those two things is just a really fun time. This shirt comes in many different colors and shapes and styles, so you can check that out in my merch shelf down underneath this video. I also have pun pression mugs and pun pression pillows with actual puns all over them. So if you want to have a good time and laugh hysterically at really bad puns, you should check these out. So if you are just dying to wear your favorite Maddie to the Max merch around, now you can. For those of you that don't know, Pun Pressions is where I ask you, my wonderful Maddie squad, to tell me a pun or a puntastic dad joke and what character you would like to have me read it as. And then I do. Here we go! Edna, I've been having strange dreams lately. Last night I dreamed I was a teepee, and the night before that I dreamed I was a wigwam. Do you think that means anything? Oh, it's obvious, darling. You're just too tense. They told me the other day that my robots have been chasing people on bikes. That's ridiculous. I never programmed them to ride bikes. Hey Mel, why did the Invisible Man turn down the job offer? I don't know, Evie. Why? He couldn't see himself doing it. Some people are like slinkies. Not really good for anything. But it sure feels good to watch him fall down the stairs. Can someone please hug Spinel before she kills everyone? Hey, what do you call a naked pasta? What? A noodle! Huh? What's the best thing about Switzerland? I don't know, but the flag is a big plus. Oh, -ho! how do you stop a rhino from charging? Huh? You take away his credit card. Huh? <laughs> hey, did you hear about the guy with the broken hearing aid? Nope. Neither did he. <laughs> What'd you say? Why was King Arthur's army too tired to fight? All those sleepless nights. I just burned 20 hundred calories! That's the last time I leave brownies in the oven while I take a nap. <laughs> hey, Steven. I'm reading a book about anti-gravity, and it's impossible to put it down. But it How many babies does it take to paint a wall? Uh, I don't know. Depends on how hard you throw them! <laughs> I hate myself for laughing at that joke. But I did laugh at that joke. What do you call a bear with no teeth? What? A gummy bear! I'm expressing my feelings with emojis! I'm emojital! If Pinkie Pie hasn't actually said that already, it's a travesty. <laughs> so, this one says to do it as Pikachu, but if I did it as Pikachu, it would just be Pika, 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 I mean, that wouldn't work, so I'm gonna do it as Ash Ketchum instead. Unless you were talking about me trying to do it as Ryan Reynolds Pikachu? No. What do you call a dog going scuba diving? Scooby-Doo! <laughs> Who is the smartest Pixar character? Buzz Lightyear! Because he can count to infinity and beyond! <laughs> when is a piece of wood like a king? When it's a ruler! Hey, Steven, what's the world's best skeleton detective? What? Sherlock Bones! <laughs> What's a skeleton? I'm sorry, I did that twice in one video. I'm sorry. What is the headmaster's favorite door? I have no clue. The Dumbledore! What did the astronaut cook in his skillet? What? Unidentified frying objects. It has been too long since puns have entered my life and hopefully yours. Once again, my merch is on my back and under this video. Let me know what you think of my new merchandise. I want to hear your opinions. And if there's something you do want that's not there, please let me know. I'm always trying to think with what you guys would really like. So tell me in the comments. Fan art of the week goes to Devil Bees. Ah! For this amazing Professor Flora's fan art. Ooh, that's a bit of a tongue twister. Professor Flora fan art. Professor Flora fan art. Professor Flora fan art. <laughs> Professor Flora is my Hogwarts professor character over on TikTok, because I never talk about TikTok enough. And this fan art is just 
beautiful. Oh my gosh, I'm like, I lost it when I saw this. I cannot even. So thank you, thank you very much for this amazing art. If you want to have your art featured in Fan Art of the Week, then you can tag me at maddie to max on Instagram or Twitter or TikTok. And your art could be featured in the next Fan Art of the Week. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button. That really helps me. And from now until next time, don't you forget to keep smiling. Mwah! That was a horrible one. Mwah! That was even worse. I'm, I'm doing... Mwah! There we go. That's it. For pun pressions, number nine. Sorry, I've been watching Critical Role. <laughs> the word nine has lost all of its original meaning. Dipper is always afraid when Bill makes a pun. I would be too. It's Bill. All of his jokes come with a knife in the back, tied to a bomb, attached to a sinking submarine. It's just his kind of humor. <laughs>